He may be the best hope for folks in the Gulf who need money from the $20 billion BP oil spill fund. And when Ken Feinberg met with Gulf residents in La Rose Friday, he came armed with straight talk. A program like this cannot be designed or administered from Washington. You have to come down here, hear what people say. Feinberg told the group, many already frustrated by the BP run claims operation, that he would streamline the process, making it easier for those who filed claims to get money quicker. But that money is only temporary relief for the seafood captains, distributors, and others whose operations have been shut down. Kimberly Chauvin's husband is a commercial fisherman, dock owner, and operator. My husband is a fourth generation commercial fisherman in, in our family. My boys are the fifth. I have a grandson, which would be the sixth, should he choose it. But how do you bring that back? Feinberg said he'll use BP's billions to fulfill the company's pledge to make the Gulf and its residents whole again, but acknowledged there's only so much money can do. Every 10 years or so, you got a big, big shrimp season. I've worked 28 years to get to this year. This was the one, cold winter, everything perfect. I'm sitting back, lick, licking my shot. My whole life worked for this year, and here comes BP. How you put a price on that? All I can do, and it may not be much, frankly, is sit with you here what you've been through and what you're suffering and try and give you the one thing I can give you, compensation. And after all this region has been through, it's understandable that most folks here are cynical when it comes to promises from Washington. Now the responsibility falls to Feinberg to turn his promises into action. Jason Bronis, The Associated Press, LaRose, Louisiana.